In recent news, Will Smith's name has become a topic of intense interest due to some surprising allegations that have emerged regarding his purported connections with multiple individuals over the course of his career. These allegations have garnered significant attention and sparked extensive discussions. As the saying goes, where there's smoke, there's fire. It seems that Will Smith has added to the intrigue by shedding light on his desire for escapism from his marital relationship. But now Black Twitter has claimed it <laughs> as their business. While being part of an unconventional family with unique marital dynamics is one thing, it becomes an entirely different situation when persistent rumors suggest that your husband may be entangled in clandestine relationships. Such is the current predicament in the Smith household, and it seems that the lady of the house has decided to openly disclose the reality. Prepare yourself, as the recent revelations surrounding Will Smith are undeniably astounding. Considering Will's numerous marriages and a lengthy history of romantic entanglements with various women, it seems that his past experiences go beyond just heterosexual relationships. Hey, Paul, come on, stop that. I was wondering if I could fuck you. Man, I don't do things like that. The journey began with the release of the enduring comedy drama Six Degrees of Separation, in which Will Smith delivered a captivating performance as a charismatic con artist. The film gained significant attention when reports surfaced that a kissing scene between Smith and his co-star Anthony Michael Hall had been curiously omitted from the final cut. This incident ignited a whirlwind of speculation. Did the celebrated actor intentionally avoid the kiss to circumvent potential scrutiny of his own SO? These rumors have endured over the years, and the truth remains shrouded in mystery. That Will Smith is bisexual and that they do this, this, and that. Additionally, during a 2020 interview, Will Smith contradicted his previous statements about not fully immersing himself in the character, stating that he had wholeheartedly embraced the method acting approach for six degrees of separation. The only intelligent creatures in the universe, especially since we're not. In a recent development, Tisha Campbell has come forward with allegations that Will Smith was involved in extramarital relationships with her former spouse, Dwayne Martin. She took to Instagram to share an image regarding this matter. In her post, Tisha pointed out that the truth always comes out in the end, no matter how many times someone lies. This prompted one of her devotees to reply, thank you even though they lie in the end. In response to this person, Tisha said, and you're right, they will lie till the end. The real kiki is, people will stop believing them. Tisha's choice to capitalize Will in her post gave rise to suspicions that she might be indirectly alluding to Will and Jada. Swift assumptions were made that this could potentially suggest an alleged affair between Will and Tisha's ex-husband, Dwayne Martin, who also shares a close friendship with the actor from Gemini Man. Dwayne and Tisha have like a real like, violent relationship. <coughs> and Dwayne's at Hi, honey. Hey, you're about to get her beat with a bag of oranges. Furthermore, YouTuber Trisha Paytas made allegations against Will Smith, claiming that he intentionally caused harm to her male dancers. She specifically said, How about worry about your daughter being in bed at 13 with her 20-year-old boyfriend? How about worry about your F cheating husband F, one of my male dancers when they didn't want to? Nonetheless, it seems that Will may have been inspired by the trail blazed by his predecessor, Quincy Jones. For those not well acquainted with Quincy Jones, he is a versatile talent who has collaborated with legends such as Frank Sinatra, Aretha Franklin, and the king of pop, Michael Jackson. However, his renown doesn't end there. Rumors about his attraction to men have circulated for years, and recent developments hint that there could be some validity to these speculations. My first musical memory is when I wanted to be a gangster until I was 11, coming from Chicago in the 30s. Recent revelations have shed light on the notion that Quincy Jones may not conform to conventional SO. Shocking allegations have surfaced, implying that he exerted influence over the S preferences of prominent figures, among them Will Smith and Tupac. These assertions allude to his extensive involvement within the LGBTQ community. Can you recall that unforgettable interview with Tupac? It was a pivotal moment when he disclosed the questionable motives of Quincy Jones. Yeah, I think these definitely, them rumors about Quincy Jones and all that crazy stuff about Pop was definitely rumors. Tupac openly revealed that Quincy had made inappropriate propositions, alluding to engaging in specific intimate activities. However, the plot thickens. Despite the interview gaining significant attention on the internet, it mysteriously vanished without a trace. It's worth acknowledging that a person of considerable power and influence could orchestrate such a disappearance. 
appearance. With Tupac no longer around to confirm the authenticity of that interview, it's not entirely surprising that Quincy might be seeking to distance himself from these allegations. And it's nice, it gives you hope when you see it's already right. happened. You know, you don't have to come up yeah. with it yourself. Even Napoleon, who is purportedly a close associate of Tupac, promptly dismissed all rumors and staunchly defended Quincy Jones when confronted with the allegations. In a moment, he swept aside all the gossip surrounding the matter. Yeah, I think these definitely, them rumors about Quincy Jones and all that crazy stuff about Pac was definitely rumors. Pac was about to marry his daughter, you know, QD3. Was, was producing. But if you thought the revelation stopped there, guess again. Rumors are swirling that Jada and Will have been hosting some rather unique gatherings at their place, with much younger gentlemen involved. Jaguar Wright even spilled some intriguing details, hinting that she's seen these young men leaving their home in a state of amazement. In contrast to the idea of Will Smith being just an ordinary father showing affection by giving his son, Jaden Smith, a gentle peck on the cheek, their relationship surpasses traditional norms. Their displays of affection have reached a level that goes beyond the usual. On multiple occasions, observers have noticed Will planting kisses on Jaden's lips. While some may quickly view it as innocent paternal love, there are others beginning to raise inquisitive eyebrows. Speculations have emerged, hinting at the possibility of more intricate undertones beyond simple affectionate bonding. That sh we saw on Red Table Talk, oh, that, that, was, that was G, that was G-rated. That was, that was G-rated shit. What I will say that I do know about the Smiths. Will Smith's affectionate gestures stirred discomfort among his fans, leading to public reaction. Many people criticized him for seemingly making his son, Jaden, uncomfortable by frequently planting kisses on his lips. Despite the increasing scrutiny, Will consistently denied any insinuations of impropriety, asserting that these gestures did not cause Jaden any discomfort. On this matter, one person commented, That's disgusting. No one kisses their kids on the mouth like that, especially when the kids are teenagers. I can't believe people are cheering this kind of behavior. Another person wrote, This is definitely CA, and there is always a negative impact on the child. When adults do certain things, they should try to not just think about themselves alone, but the impact of their actions on their children. Whispers are swirling about Will and his wife Jada, who supposedly throw extravagant shindigs at their place. Apparently, these gatherings often feature younger male guests, and according to the candid Jaguar Wright, they might be pushing the boundaries of tradition. Some folks even claim they've seen these young men leave the Smith's house looking all flustered. The spooky part? Supposedly, you can hear their distressing cries echoing through the night, adding a layer of mystery to these events. His corny, overbooked was not built to be able to maintain the swag of a Baltimore ch That is true. When you dig into the backstory of these extraordinary and offbeat events, it appears that Will might have taken a page out of the playbook of the legendary maestro Quincy Jones. This music producer and musician extraordinaire has had a career spanning more decades than we can count and has seen and heard it all in the industry. Surprisingly, he's not one to shy away from dishing the dirt on his celebrity pals. In a jaw-dropping interview with Vulture magazine, Quincy Jones spilled the beans on some unexpected truths, revealing that folks like James Baldwin, Richard Pryor and Marvin Gaye had more to their stories. And if you're curious about what he said about Marlon Brando, he was the most charming MF you ever met. He'd F anything, anything. He'd F a mailbox. James Baldwin, Richard Pryor, Marvin Gaye. After Quincy Jones dropped those bombshell statements, a well-known YouTuber chimed in and claimed that Quincy might be keeping a few secrets of his own, suggesting that he identifies as bisexual. This YouTuber wasn't too thrilled with Quincy's comments and questioned whether he was the right person to spill the beans on anyone else's gender inclinations, considering his own revelations. Quincy Jones, if you always tell the truth, well, tell me this, are you bisexual? But wait, there's more to this saga. The YouTuber didn't stop at the allegations. They went a step further, claiming they had a Hollywood-connected friend. And this friend had some interesting interactions with none other than Quincy Jones himself. To have a friend who is really attractive and gay, guess what? You learn a lot of things about the men in Hollywood. Adding to the allegations concerning Quincy Jones, the deceased actress Alexis Arquette also made a claim that Cherie Zampino, Will Smith's former wife, divorced him after reportedly witnessing Will in a compromising situation with another man. She said, when Jada comes out as gay, 
and her beard husband admits his first marriage ended when she walked into him, servicing his sugar daddy Benny Medina, then I will listen to them, she later clarified in the comments section. She being his first wife, paid off, silent. Surprisingly, Jada, who's known for her outspoken stance on boycotting the Oscars, opted to remain silent regarding Alexis's statement. In contrast, Will chose not to comment on the accusations. It was his first wife, Cherie Zampino, who decided to speak up. She criticized Alexis for her seemingly vindictive and rushed comments, making it clear that Will has never identified as queer. Not only is it out of line, it's absolutely not true. And I'm offended and I'm hurt. Well, now people speculate that they have always seen Jada speaking about her past relationships and never acknowledged Will as she should, and that is why Will had enough of his wife and ultimately he engaged himself in such weird stuff. That's it for today, folks. Until next time, goodbye.